Hey guys, welcome back to No Catch Your Name. It's me, Ella, and today is the 29th of August. It's Saturday. Today's Devin's birthday, my husband. He is 26 today, but he has to work. Boo. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, vlogist is almost over. So 29, 30, 31. There's only three more days. I'm gonna try, maybe I'll try to make a video all three of these days. Well, this is one of them. So there's only two more left. <laughs> but, um, anyways, I just got done with all the bags for the next shop update, and it's going to be tomorrow morning which is august the 30th uh sunday it's going to be they're going to go live um seven o'clock central time <laughs> in the u.s because that's what time zone i'm in um i'm not sure what that is for everybody else <laughs> you just have to uh convert it yourself because i i know that eastern time is one hour ahead of us but that's about all i know <laughs> um yeah, so I, there's so many bags. Oh my gosh, I think there's 96 all together in this next update. It's a lot of bags. So I'm going to kind of show you some of them. I'm, you know, there's multiples of some, so I'm just going to show you one of all the ones going to be in the shop tomorrow. So yeah, we'll start with the, the zipper bags, the uh, Notion pouches. There's a bunch of them. I think I got them all mostly separated. Okay, so there's, you know, I know there's some of these missing. There they are. <laughs> All right, there's four candy corns. <laughs> and these would be good for, I use mine for my hooks, my crochet hooks fit in here. Uh, scissors, measuring tapes, yarn needles. They'd be good for other things. I guess if you wear makeup, you could put them in here or uh, anything in your purse, or you could even use it as a little gift bag to put some candies in and give to someone. Just ideas. Candy corns. And then there's gonna be two with Christmas lights on them, just like strands of Christmas lights. There's going to be two with this print. It's like a Christmas mix. <laughs> it's got different sayings and stuff on it. There are also, there's one with these like scarecrow witches. There's one with this nautical theme, nautical beach theme. There are two of the like autumn leaves. There's two of these ones. It's just colorful circles, ovals. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of this print. And it's um, like Christmassy farm print. Got different farm animals on them. I'm trying to stack those up. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. There's five of the, the festive... <laughs> Christmas themed uh, dogs and cats. There are dogs and cats on here. There's one of the cats. And there's a cat right there. So there's five of those. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There are seven of the festive llamas. <laughs> they got Christmas or gifts, Christmas, whatever. Santa hats, Christmas lights, scarves, stuff on them. And there's also seven of this star print. It's got, it's like different shades of blue, like, like the sky, I guess. And the stars are shiny. <laughs> They're not glittery. It doesn't come off. It's just shiny looking. So that's all the zipper notion pouches that'll be in the shop tomorrow. Now, there's also little drawstring bags, big drawstring bags, and quilted tote bags. So little drawstring bags. Okay, so this is like a normal drawstring bag right here. These are the normal size that I make. These, the little ones are small. <laughs> I think these would be good for small projects like little amigurumis, socks, a hat, things like that. Or you could even use it as a gift bag for Christmas or whichever because there's some regular ones and some Halloween ones. Or you could just, I have one actually with Halloween cats on it that I put all my camera stuff in, my um, accessories for when I'm making tutorials, which I haven't done that in forever. But uh, they're all in there. <laughs> so there's going to be two of these with cardinals on it. That are little and the sizes are in the description of the product i always put the description the sizes in the description of the product on my Etsy shop i've had a couple people talk to me about that um saying that they thought maybe a bag was going to be bigger or smaller than it is but i always put sizes in there so <laughs> if you don't see the sizes um they're there i just you can just overlook them i guess but there's this one with a little like toucan birds on it little and there's a little bird cage one and a little one with uh like autumn leaves a little bag with 
orange and pink and green circles. <laughs> and then, let's see here. This is another normal one. It's a little one with cats with yarn balls. This is a little one with figs on it. This is a little one with snowflakes. Cute gift bags, I think. <laughs> this is a little one with um, like Halloween drinks <laughs> and cupcakes. I like this one. Eyeballs. <laughs> Halloween eyeballs. And then this one's uh, still little, but it's bigger than those little ones. <laughs> it's just a little bit bigger. It's got like a floral print on it. Now these ones, I'm having a hard time getting the labels to stick to these ones for some reason. I don't know if it's the labels or what, but I'm going to re-iron them and see if I can get them to stick on there better. If you order these little bags and there's not a label on them, it's because I was unsuccessful getting them to stick. I don't know why. None of the other bags messed up, but all the little bags, so I'm thinking it's the labels. Um... Which is just not sticking on there the way they're supposed to. Alright, so now the big project bags. There are multiples of these. Okay, there's two of this print. Which is again the Christmas. It's like sayings and uh, Christmas trees and little trucks. There's one of these. This is a bigger version of that little bag. There are two of these. Which is pretty uh, leaf pattern. Hey, bub. There are three of these. They're colorful. There are two of these Christmas light ones. Big. I'm gonna show this one now. There are two with autumn leaves. There's one of the nautical beach thing. One witch. It's like a scarecrow witch. Okay, there are two of these Halloween ones. That does ones. look like a scarecrow witch. Yeah, it does. Can you go over there? Because you don't have any clothes on. Go that way. Oh, <laughs> uh, this cute Halloween print. There's two of those. There's one. My arm's getting tired. There's one of this uh, Daisy print. I'll maybe wait in here until I get some clothes on. Oh, okay, dokie. Okay. And then there's seven of these star ones. <laughs> I had a lot of this. I got it uh, really cheap. I got, like, I think almost four yards of it really cheap for, like, $3, I think. And again, they're uh, shiny but not glittery. It doesn't like fall off. And that's all the duplicates of those. So let's just pile them up there. So many bags. Okay, and then last, there are tote bags. I have a big old stack here. Holy crap. Yeah, there's a bunch of them ain't there. Which one am I missing? Just the bottom one. All right. Now for the tote bags. There are five. <laughs> Of the the Christmassy farm ones, the quilted tote bags with the handles. <laughs> it's hard to hold them up. There are five of the uh, and that, that insides all out. It's because I was taking pictures of it, so the inside got pulled out. <laughs> of the uh, the dogs and cats, five of them, and there's also five of the llama print. They all have either green or red inside. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure. There might be a couple with just random ones if I ran out of uh, the liner. And then each of these ones, there's only one of each of these. So there's this Halloween print. It says Happy Haunting. Cute. This cute bat one. This Halloween print, which also it's sticking out. <laughs> I put yarn in them to take pictures of them so that they, you know, they're, they look full or whatever. That one. And then the last one is just a random yellow fabric. <laughs> it's got like a floral. This lighting's not the best. It's like a floral print. But anyways, that's all the bags that are going to be in the shop tomorrow morning, Sunday, August 30th at 7 a.m. Central Standard Time. <laughs> it's a lot to say. But uh, yeah, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to fix these ones, labels, try to get them to stick on there. I'm going to have to cut some more labels. Maybe those ones are just old or something. I don't know. I feel like I just ordered those, though, so I don't know. <laughs> but uh, I like the iron-on labels because they're easier to put on, but I feel like the sewn-on ones stick better because they're sewn on there, and uh, I'm always afraid the iron ones are going to fall off. But yeah, so that's all the bags that's going to be in the shop tomorrow, and uh, I'm going to go now put all these up so that they don't get dusty, and then I'm going to go sit down and crochet for a while because I've been sewing 
pretty much all week and I'm tired of sewing. <laughs> I want to sit down and crochet. I haven't crocheted at all in like two and a half days and I miss it. But I'm going to hop off here and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye guys.